Hey everybody, it's Rick and I got John behind the camera. Say hey John. Hello, hello. All right, and we're going to go over a couple of new releases we have for this week and the restocks we're going to be getting out on the shelves for you uh, tonight and tomorrow. Okay. Uh, anyway, first up for our new releases is the latest from the Avet Brothers. Uh, this one's called uh, Emotionalism. Okay. Sounds uh, like a very emotional is, album. That's right. Um, they have uh, kind of got this um, almost Americana kind of uh, acoustic sound to them. All yeah. Right. We kind of like it. We were listening to it a little bit. Okay. Kind of Munford feel. Yep. All right. Uh, and this one is uh, on sea glass uh, t uh, blue vinyl. Okay. Oh, there you go. That could be interesting. Right. That's right. Uh, then we got a re-release of uh, the Monkey's Greatest Hits. Okay. Here they come. All right. Mike Walking Nesman, Davy Jones, Peter... Uh, Torque. Peter Tork. I was going to say Tosh. And <laughs> I forget, uh, Mickey something, I believe. Mickey uh, Dolans. Mickey Dolans. There we go. All right. So there we go. There's only four, for Monkey. God's sake. <laughs> <laughs> uh, and then uh, the latest from uh, Portugal, The Man. Okay. All right, Portugal the Man. This one is called um, uh, Chris Black Changed My Life. Yeah, right. Do you know who Chris Black is? I have no idea. I don't either. Okay. okay but, well, uh, there we go. That's their latest album, and that's on uh, Clear Vinyl. Okay. Cool. All right. Uh, then uh, we're going to hit our um, new rest uh, restocks that we've just got in. Uh, first up is the um, uh, first album by the 1975. And uh, we want to make a mention that um, uh, 1975 will be here um, in Tampa, uh, I believe, in October. Sure. And we will be giving away some tickets Ooh. for that show. Okay, so that's uh, kind of a little bit of a promotion that we're going to be doing. So uh, we'll have some more news about that uh, very soon. Okay. There's right. some girls from Record Store Day to be go. very interested mm -hmm. in that. That's right. Uh, then we've got uh, one by uh, Chet Baker, Chet Baker in New York, okay, 180 gram vinyl, all right, okay. You like uh, Chet Baker there, uh, John? Yeah, I heard he even recorded in New York. Oh, well, I would hope Hence so. Hence the title, right? <laughs> <laughs> uh, then we've got a copy, a couple copies of Black Sabbath Volume 4. Yep. They're okay. going through changes, great Maybe song on that there album. There you go, okay. Uh, then we've got uh, Blink 182's Dude Ranch, okay. There we go. Okay. Great album right there. I'm sure I can okay. tell by the cover. That's it interesting. Is. That's it an is interesting a great cover. album. Mm -hmm. <laughs> All right. And then uh, the Jeff Buckley uh, with his album Grace. Okay. That's the right. famous Hallelujah album. Mm -hmm. Okay. Nice Leonard Cohen. And then we've got, uh, we've got another copy back in of Extremes uh, 6. All right. And that's on uh, the red vinyl. Okay. On the red. There you go. See. And we've got uh, a few more copies of the Foo Fighters latest album, uh, it's, but uh, here we are. Okay. I haven't there listened to go. that one yet. Have you given a spin yet? Um, I have not. Yeah. No. no. Boss will be Every... very disappointed with me. Okay. Yeah. Oops. <laughs> and that's, it's getting uh, good reviews though. Yeah. Uh, and this one is on white vinyl. Okay. All right. uh, then we've got uh, Jack Johnson, uh, and this one's called In Between the Dub. Uh, lots of um, remixes by different artists and things like that. Okay. Looks interesting. Okay, and then we've got Eartha Kit. Yeah, look at that. Uh -huh. Earth Kit, and this one is her Bad But Beautiful. Okay. And um, uh, she was uh, Catwoman, correct? Yeah. Catwoman. Yeah. At in, some uh, point, yeah, somewhere. Mm -hmm. I remember okay. her. Back in uh, Maybe the... Maybe in the series, uh, yeah. In the series, the original TV series. I might have to grab that album. Back in stock, uh, Limp Bizkit. Um, haven't seen this in a long time, but uh, just getting it in. Significant Other. Okay. Okay. And this has got Break Stuff, Nookie, so they're oh, big okay. hits. Okay. Is that their, I guess, their first one, right? Because that's their um, first big hit, I know. I think so, yeah. Yeah. Uh, then we got a couple more copies of oh, Lives, yeah. uh, Throwing Copper. Got to get okay. it. Yep. Great I album. do have a copy of that. Okay. It sounds great. And then back in stock, Mazzy Star, and uh, their album is called So Tonight That I Might See. What was the what was it called? Fade Into Fade You? Fade Into You yes. was the big track off of that one. Great yeah. song. Mm -hmm. Okay. All right, then uh, let's get over here, and we've got uh, Megadeth, and this one was called Dystopia. Okay. Looks like a very upbeat, positive yep. album. And Dystopia will actually be opening, or uh, sorry, Megadeth will be opening <laughs> for uh, the Misfits on Saturday night. Okay. Okay. Anybody going to that show? I will see you there. Just 
Give me a wave, say hi, all right? Leave it all in right. the comments below. That's right, okay, looking forward to it, okay. Now we got um, Metallica's latest uh, 72 seasons, a couple more copies of that back in, okay. And uh, also the Metallica's The Black Album, okay, all right. Uh, then we got another one in from Mac Miller, and this one is called The Good AM. They're just flowing in the Mac Miller yeah. recently. Yeah, they're just putting everything, uh, re-releasing everything. So, okay. Uh, then we've got uh, Muse and their album, The Resistance. Okay. Looks like you're a trip to uh, Epcot Center. Mm-hmm. All right. Uh, then we got uh, back in uh, My Chemical Romance and uh, their great album, uh, The Black Parade. Okay. okay. Uh, then we got uh, The Nirvana and their first LP, Bleach. Okay. Very heavy album for what I remember. It was. Yep. And Queen. And this was a great album called uh, The Game. Uh, that had uh, Another One Bites the Dust and Crazy Little Thing Called Love. It almost feels like those would have been from different albums, right? Like two totally know, different yeah. feels, right, mm -hmm. for songs. The Smiths and their um, album Strange Ways Here We Come. Okay. Very cool. And then it wouldn't be a good week if we didn't have some Taylor Swift in there. So there's Taylor T Swizzle with uh, the 1989. Gotta have it. Mm -hmm. Okay. And then uh, last uh, for this week is uh, the self-titled by um, 30 Seconds to Mars. Okay, so those are new releases and restocks for this week. Um, I do believe we're also going to be getting some more copies in of Smashing Pumpkins, Melancholy, and Infinite Sadness. Um, so we should be getting those in sometime next week. Um, and uh, have a great weekend. I think that should be it. Oh, also, yeah, CDs. Thank you, John. Uh, CDs are still three for ten. Don't forget that. We've still got plenty uh, that you guys can come and choose from. Lots of great titles still in there. Yep, okay. tons over here and way over way there. Over on the there. table. Okay. All right. Making our audience sick. There we go. <laughs> Um, and uh, again, anybody going to Misfits on uh, Saturday night uh, for Fear, Megadeth, and the Misfits, I'll hope to see you there. All right. And have a great weekend, and we'll see you in the store. Okay. Thanks. Thanks, Sean. Yep. Thanks. All right. Bye. Bye.